I'm Jerry Lockwood, Rapid View Service Technician. In today's tech tip, we're going to learn how to separate the MP4 spring coupling from our MP4 cable. Now it's important to know how to do it properly because if you don't do it properly, you can actually twist the wires inside and uh, they'll break inside the epoxy. So IBOC has come up with these two spanners. They're both identical, but you require two of them. There's four different sizes on there. 20 millimeter, 25, 27, and 28. For our purposes, all four, of them are, all four sizes are on here. So we just gotta find the right size. First part we're gonna take off is this outer cover. Our cables are nice and clean here in the shop. You might have to clean this off before you start. Uh, make sure you disinfect it. before Ours uh, are nice and clean so we can get a good grip on them. So we wanna separate this part. This is gonna be a 20, 25 millimeter and a 28 millimeter. We're going to separate the cover from here and we're going to undo this and slide it so we expose the spring coupling. Now from here we want to bring the spring coupling out of the groove. We'll make sure this is out of the groove in there and we'll pull back. There's a plastic sliding piece. Everything's all black and it's kind of hard to see, but you move this back about five, five millimeters and pull out these small parallel pins. There's two each of these in the coupling. Make sure you take them both out. If you don't take them out, it won't allow this inner assembly to free spin. Now our next item we're going to separate, there's a coupling here. It's about 10 millimeters wide. We're going to separate this thin one from this outer one. You just got to move your spanners around in such a way that they'll get the proper connection and proper size on all of them. Just break it loose. And once you break it loose, you should see the inner black part of your of your connector turn, but your yellow cable should not turn. It's free spinning inside, and that's what we did by disconnecting those parallel pins. So we'll hold it in place with our left hand and undo the coupling. And if you can see in here, after we get the coupling off, this is what it looks like on the inside. This inner, this inner white piece here on your coupling is what's free spinning. When you take those out, you should be able to free spin. Well, we'll go ahead and take this off. <laughs> it plugs into your circuit card. It's no big deal. That's our next step. But when you look in here, you can get your needle nose pliers. Make sure that free spins in there away from your outer your outer piece because if not it'll turn and twist these wires inside the epoxy and eventually break them off and uh, with this inner piece here that's held in place by these parallel pins and we'll just set those off to the side and that is how you uh, remove your mp4 spring coupling assembly and that'll be it for our tech tip. Got any suggestions for next time? Please let us know at rapidview.com or give us a call at the work center.